This is a video of me and Renee going to the haunted cave. Or as some other people here call it, the love cave. I'm not sure which name I prefer, but it's pretty cool. To get to the cave, you have to walk a lot and climb a little. The ground underneath you looks rocky because it's made out of rocks, but it looks really cool because of the cracks and stuff, because of the erosion uh, from the waves that crash onto it during high tide. It's low tide now, which is why we are not drowning. When we climb, it is sometimes difficult, and so Renee helps his younger brother. We continue to walk up and down and around in order to reach the cave. None of us have ever been to the cave before, although we can see it from on top of the mountain of Jesus. It is exciting and also kind of scary as we do not know what to expect. Walking here, we think of all sorts of things, but mostly about how cool the rocks look and how cool the plants are and the sky and also the ocean and how it's all sort of pushed together by itself. The waves crashing on the er land, eroding, changing, making the rocks smooth. And the rocks crashing to into each other, making them broken. When we reach the cave, it is dark, but not too dark. And there are waves, but they're not scary, even though they're big and loud. I watched them for a while. They're pretty cool. When continuing into the cave, it looks more and more like a haunted cave and less like a love cave. The driftwood reminds me of bones, but then I look and see that it is driftwood, and I realize that it is driftwood and not bones, and so I keep walking. I'm almost to the back of the cave now, and at this point, in a typical YouTube video, you would be getting screamed at, but you're not going to get screamed at in this one because I'm nice. So instead I'm going to keep showing you the cave. There is a bug inside of the cave. It's very big, but you can't tell that it's big because my camera is small. The bug has wings, but it decides to walk. And so we also walk, even though the bug wasn't the reason for our walking. We walk, and we see a pair of flip-flops. The person who was here before chose to walk too, but they forgot their sandals. I imagine that they got swept away in the ocean and then swam back to shore, or else swam to Costa Rica or something. They probably didn't, though. I have no clue how those sandals got there. Maybe somebody once lived in the cave. That was my dad's idea. I'm not sure. There's a crab up here. I'm not going to see it, though until I turn around and walk back and see a crab. The crab is small and I continue walking.
because I don't really care much for the crab. Which is sort of strange, I guess. We climb, and we continue walking to the edge, almost. We see the waves, and we decide to not go any further. It is beautiful. Later, we climb to the top of a hill, and we look down upon this cove. Yeah.